Good morning, my friends. Welcome back to Keto in the Chaos. My name is Tammy, and this is an episode of What to Eat Wednesday. Wait a minute, it's Friday, you say? Yeah, well, about that. Sorry, you guys, my kids had a crazy week this week. We had three days of dance recital prep. So we had pictures and I was photographing the entire studio, uh, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday before dress rehearsal, dress rehearsal, and recital. So I just haven't had a chance to get this video put together until today, but happy Friday and Sorry about being late on my video, but I have been recording everything I eat just like I always do, so I wanted to make sure you guys got to see that. So this week ought to be a little less crazy, I hope. This weekend I have two kids in a Shakespeare production of The Tempest. My 15-year-old son is playing Ferdinand and Trinculo, and my little nine-year-old Blondie is playing a um, gnome, nymph, nymph, fairy something like that, and she gets to sing her lines, which is kind of cute. So I'm looking forward to having a little bit of relaxing, just gonna go watch the show instead of having to do everything for the production, which is gonna be kind of nice. And then the crazy month of March would actually be almost over. Following week will be my daughter's fifth birthday, so I will have one small, set a few days to throw together a really awesome fifth birthday party for my cute little daughter who is turning five on Easter of all days. Easter and April Fool's Day. Fools on me, that's for dang sure. But we'll figure it out, we'll make it work. We always do, we find some way to do it. April ought to be a little bit less crazy, so <laughs> hopefully I'll get back to doing regular videos and we won't have to take too many breaks or be late like I am now. But anyway, on to the video. You can see what I ate last week. Good Wednesday morning, everyone. This is my first meal of the day. It is almost two o'clock and I am finally eating my first meal. I spend a lot of time shopping today for dance competition stuff and so I'm getting a late start. So today I'm having um, keto pancakes that are made with two eggs, one egg white, one ounce of um, one third less fat Philadelphia cream cheese, a little bit of vanilla, a little bit of cinnamon, and a dropper of stevia. And then I'm going to use my yogurt, 227 grams of 0% Faye Greek yogurt. And I sweetened it with Mio water enhancer, the mango peach. And I'm going to roll the yogurt up inside the pancakes like little crepes. It's going to be delicious. Then I have 35 grams of Thick Cut Center Cut Bacon, the Dailies brand. And a giant cup of Creo Brew. This is about two servings of Creo Brew with stevia and half and half. And Creo Brew is what I like to drink in the morning just because I like a drink with my food. And it is ground cocoa beans. And that's going to be my first meal of the day. Alrighty, for my second meal today, I am going to have a Wendy's. I have two four-ounce patties with a lettuce wrap and a salad with ranch dressing. And these cute girls just had an awesome practice for their competition coming up this weekend. They get to do their solos for the first time. Two days. We're so excited. That's going to be my last meal of the day. Okay, today at Commonwealth School, this is going to be my first meal. I cooked um, basically half of a spaghetti squash, eight minutes in the microwave. I put on one ounce of one third less fat cream cheese and mixed it in with the noodles. Um, then I put on two ounces of mozzarella cheese and some of, sorry, some of this Foster Farms chicken breast strips, half of a bag and then three slices of the big pepperoni. And then I'm also gonna have 170 grams of Faye Greek yogurt, and that's going to be my first meal of the day. Alrighty guys, for dinner tonight, I went for the half pound roast beef at Arby's with no bun and the side salad with ranch. And that's going to be my last meal of the day. 
All right, my awesome son made me breakfast while we are putting on makeup and getting ready to head out to our dance competition. Two eggs, about 40 grams of center cut bacon, an ounce of cheddar cheese, and 227 grams of Faye Greek yogurt sweetened with orange vanilla mio. And that's gonna be my first meal of the day. I don't usually snack, but I'm at a dance competition and need something. So I'm gonna have a little bit of carbs. <laughs> and these are the carbs I'm gonna have. Six ounces. Don't believe it. Okay, we're heading out now, and this is going to be my glorious breakfast. Two bags of peanuts and some hard salami wrapped mozzarella cheese. It's probably going to be over my fat, but I figure that can only be a good thing today when I really need to not be hungry. And I just really hope it's enough food because it doesn't look like it's going to be to me. But I can at least eat it in the car on the way there. So that's the way it's going to be. Show my fish. Oh, no, you didn't see the rice. There's no rice and I'm not eating it. I promise. It's just fish. Alrighty, here's going to be my last meal of the day. I have eight chicken wings and some spinach and two tablespoons of yogurt blue cheese dressing. And that's going to be my last meal of the day. Okay, so here's my first meal today. I have keto pancakes, which is basically two eggs and an egg white, an ounce of cream cheese, and a little bit of half and half stevia, cinnamon, and vanilla. Two ounces of mozzarella cheese, 30 grams of green sugar snap peas, 227 grams of Faye 0% Greek yogurt, sweetened with lemonade mio, and a mug of Creo brew, with stevia and half and half and that is going to be my first meal of this Sunday. All right, we're having dinner at Grammy's and we are having country style ribs and some broccoli and a yummy delicious salad with homemade ranch dressing and that is going to be my last meal of this Sunday. Hey Jasper, is it good? Mmm, mmm good. All right, we're heading out for a big photo shoot today, and I am taking my food on the go, and it's just my typical breakfast. 43 grams of center cut bacon, two eggs, one ounce of cheese, and 227 grams of Faye Greek yogurt with lemonade meal, and that's gonna be my first meal of the day. All righty, so I just finished up five hours of dance portraits, and I'm heading to the theater for our dress rehearsal. So I'm stopping at Wendy's and grabbing a triple, Dave's triple um, burger and a side salad, and that is going to be my last meal of the day. Happy Tuesday, everyone. I am actually eating at the table today, which is kind of shocking, I know. Um, getting ready to get the girls started on their hair and makeup and head down to picture day again, but this is what I'm going to have. It's my typical breakfast. Two fried eggs, 47 grams of Daly's brand center cut bacon, two ounces of pepper jack cheese, 160 grams of Faye 0% Greek yogurt sweetened with orange vanilla meal, and a cup of Creo brew sweetened with stevia and half and half. And that's going to be my first meal of the day. All right, it is 10.30 at night, actually. I think it's actually 10.52 at this point. 10.52, I am eating late again after a very long day of photographing dancers and going to our dress rehearsal. So I am starting out with this yummy salad and some blue cheese dressing. And the main event, wings, hot wings, delicious. And there you have it. So if you wanna know more about doing a higher protein, lower fat keto, go ahead and join my Facebook group. In The, the link is in the about section below. I do keto a little differently than um, most people that are on YouTube. So if you wanna see what, what, what's up with that, go ahead and join us. Um, we have a macros chart and a way to get started on our Facebook page. If you do not have Facebook, please email me at ketochaos at gmail.com and I will go ahead and send you our macros chart for free and you can share it with anybody that you like. Just a disclaimer that I wasn't very awesome with tracking this week, so if it looks like I may have overeaten my macros, I definitely have. It has just been one of those times when I have to go, 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 and I have to go from here and what I know I can usually eat, and so I probably overate my macros a few days this week. But 
I am super not stressed about it, and I stayed keto all through this craziness of March, so I'm pretty proud of myself. Like I said, it would be a miracle if I lose any weight in March, and I have lost some, so I am thrilled about that. Anyway, I will see you guys later, probably on Sunday for the weigh-in, and I will um, talk to you all again soon.